Welcome to the class. In today's session, we are going to see the term 2 in EDS second lesson, the food we eat. So why do we need food? Do you all know that? Yes, we need food to live and grow. So food gives us energy. If you keep on paying for the day, you get tired, right? But after we eat, we get some energy to play. So food also keeps us healthy and strong. So we have to eat healthy foods. Let's see the video and know further about the food we eat chapter. Food we eat. The food we eat. Play and run around in the park with your friends. But can you play and run around in the park if you feel tired? No. That is because you need energy to do all these things. We need energy for doing all our work, including playing, studying and even watching television. But from where do we get the energy to do so many things? We get energy from the food we eat. Food gives us energy to work and play. Food helps us to grow. Food also helps us to be strong and healthy. Have you ever wondered from where does all the food we eat come from? We obtain food we eat from plants and animals. Plants provide us with a huge variety of food items. Most of the food we eat like rice, wheat, pulses, fruits and vegetables comes from plants. We use these things to make so many tasty food items. Flour made from wheat is used to make bread, chapatis and noodles. The vegetables are used to make dishes like sambar and curry. Fruits can be eaten raw or made into yummy jams. Animals also provide us with many types of food. We get milk from animals like cows, buffaloes and goats. Chickens give us eggs and meat. We get meat from goat and fish and honey from honeybees. We use animal products to make so many tasty food items. Cheese is made from milk. Other foods made from milk are butter, cream, ice cream and yogurt. Always eat healthy food and avoid food which will make us unhealthy. We should include fruits, vegetables and milk in our meals. We should reduce eating biscuits, cakes, chocolates, pizzas, burgers and ice creams. Pizzas, burgers and chips may taste good but they don't make a good choice. Children should eat healthy food to receive a lifetime bonus of a strong mind and fit body. You see the foods that we get from plants and animals? Now we are going to see the eating time. So we, we should have the food at right time. So we should have our main meal three times in a day. So we will eat three times in a day. First we eat breakfast in the morning and lunch in the afternoon and we have dinner in the night. So let's see the eating time by this animated video. Fruits for breakfast, vegetables for lunch, milk and biscuits when it's time to munch. Rice and roti, lentils and spinach. Nuts, brown bread and pulses, mommy tells me to eat. Stay of chocolates and cakes, that's what all adults say. Drink 8 glasses of water and exercise every day. Food is my best friend. Food is my best friend. So have you enjoyed the drives? Yes, you all really enjoy the drives, right? Now, we are going to see the 5 star rules for the food which makes us 
healthy and happy. These are the five star rules to keep you healthy and happy. The first rule is you should eat all kinds of fruits and vegetables. Like in the video, you can see fruits for morning and vegetables for afternoon. So you have to eat all kinds of fruits and all kinds of vegetables as well. Second main thing, you have to eat slowly and chew properly. Then only you can digest. Okay. The third thing is eat food on time. You should always eat the food on time. One, drink at least six glasses of water every day. So water is very much needed for our body. It gives us energy. So you will have to drink at least six glasses of water every day. So the last thing, wash your hands before and after eating. So this is the most important thing. You have to wash your hands before and after eating to prevent yourself from the germs. Right. So these are the five healthy rules for the to keep in mind. By taking the food, you have to keep in mind these five rules. Right. For the activity part, you have to make the food schedule and also the healthy food schedule for yourself. For Monday, for breakfast, lunch and dinner. What did you eat for the breakfast and what did you eat for the lunch and what did you eat for the dinner? Likewise, you have to make a chart for the Monday to Friday. That's right? So this is your activity. I hope you all understand the lesson and we will meet in the next session. Thank you for listening.